Hey everyone, welcome back to Super Mario Odyssey. Uh, I just realized I made the mistake of starting this recording and then realizing that I'm thirsty. And you might be saying, well, shoot, man, if you're thirsty, like, why not just drink some water? Uh, I mean, I could, but then I'd have to restart the recording. He's like, well, yeah, but you're only like a few seconds in. It's like, well, true, but I feel like I'm already committed. Uh, to which you might be saying, dude, that's. Alright, whatever, man. And then, like, he'll just give up, and then, like, he'll Something. Or who knows, maybe you're here for Wild Run, in which case, hello, welcome. Uh, so, one thing I've noticed on my time in Earth, especially the past year, is that just like how much we change in one year. Um, which is interesting because, so one year ago, I just moved into my farm and I've been in this farm and I've been like, as a recording, I think. 369 days for a year and four days because I think I'm moving on the 14th of August and so it's the 19th of August right now. Uh, and when I was, you know, a year ago, I was like, what do I do? I was like, when I start to remaster, um, I think I had it, I was streaming on Twitch every now and then. I haven't been streaming on Twitch for a while. Whoops. Uh, well, and I, it's just, it's hard to find the time. It's so, so easy to be so busy. Whereas, like, now it's like, okay, well, what's happening? So, I've, I've done all these less plays in the year. Now I'm playing Super Mario Odyssey. That's pretty cool. Uh, I work for Day 9. That's pretty sweet as well. And then, uh, Freaking TV has reached out to me. And they put players on their website. And all this has happened within a year. And then, if I look at my subscriber count, holy crap, guys. Like, so let me see. Like, a year ago, I would have been at, like... Yeah, I opened at like 21 subscribers, 22 maybe, not even that, make me only like 20. So in a year, I've grown by like a factor of 10, over 10. I dumped like 12 times larger than now than I was like a year ago, which is absolutely insane to think about. Um, and before when I made these videos, uh, I did these less places maybe like one, two, maybe three people watch these words. You know, from a less place, I get more people watching this than they were before, which is really cool and really exciting. And first of all, like, thank you guys for watching. Um, but then it's like, I can't help but ask myself, like, well, will it be a year from now, right? Like, it might, and that's the thing, is that anything could happen. Like, a year from now, my channel might not even exist as I know it, or it might not even exist at all. It might just, you know, maybe... Three months from now, I'll decide that YouTube's not something I want to do, and then I'll just like close up shop and just no longer be here. Which, uh, for the record, I I want to drive this YouTube crew until like, the day I die, man, because this is a fun hobby and I really enjoy doing it. Um, but I just don't know where it's gonna lead. And the reason why I bring up this, like, oh yeah, like, I might not be here anymore, is that it, because I, I think when you're doing these kinds of things, you want to be aware of the possible outcomes, right? Like, so for example, like, I really like doing YouTube and view editing. Like, it's just something I'm really into. Um, and I would love to be able to do it full time, but I'm just not in a position where that's possible. Like, cause I don't earn any income from YouTube. I earn a little bit of money from video editing, but it's definitely not enough to sustain myself. Like, this might be, uh, maybe like a hundred dollars a month, which I mean, sweet but that's not you know that's not gonna pay the bills or if i can get to the point where i could do this full time that would be awesome but that for me seems pretty unrealistic but again you don't know because a year from ago if we if i asked myself hey do you know do you think you'd be working for day nine or doing um work for free for tv out like absolutely no way like i never will thought where i am now would have been possible by any stretch of the imagination yet here i am right so the future is uncertain because it could happen that maybe next year like i grow big enough that i, I can like do this full time so i think that'll happen i really don't think it will but there does exist a possibility it's not completely outlandish but at the same time too I, 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 I think just for planning in general, like asking yourself like what's the worst case scenario is always a wise thing. 
to do because if you ask yourself, like, what's the worst case scenario? And then you tell yourself, you're okay, the worst case scenario, then everything's good, right? So for you two, like, when I first start doing this, it's like, okay, well, I, I'm gonna do this as a hobby. And while, like, what will be the, the worst thing that will happen if I do this YouTube? Like, obviously, you might say, like, oh, yeah, worst thing that could happen is, like, someone finds out where you live and they come and kill you. It's like, oh, well, technically, yes, but we're not gonna consider those cases because they seem pretty, uh, Pretty unlikely. So like, okay, well if I do YouTube, then uh, if no one watches my videos and I get nowhere with it, like I get zero subscribers, if no one watches my videos, then I can say it's like at the very least I had a good time doing it, which is hey, that's pretty good, right? Like to enjoy the time that you spend, like that's already worthwhile. And like that's the worst thing that's gonna happen. It's like, hey, like, I enjoyed the time I spent doing this. Oh, that's pretty good. So like, why not go for it? I also thought too is like I would regret not doing YouTube, not in the sense of like oh like I won't make a, like a career out of it. Like I would love to, if only for the idea that I can I could do it more. Um, but like I've just been even just dreaming of doing it for a hobby. I've been thinking about doing it for like, since the universe is like so literally years I've been thinking about doing it. And like now I just. You know, this is, it doesn't actually seem that long ago when I started doing it. When... Um, it, yeah, it's just... I guess what I'm, all I'm really trying to say is that I've always been interested in doing YouTube. Uh, so, and I always felt like I wanted to myself to do it. And, and not again, not because I necessarily want to go anywhere, but like, just like the act of doing it. Like, I want to create my own videos. Like, I want to do less plays. I want to play on the internet. Like, that's something I was always interested in doing, which is why I'm, like, I'm doing it. And even for, you know, these less plays I do, um, first of all, it's exciting because more people are watching these than ever before, but still not, I wouldn't say that not a lot of people are watching these. And also, I want to be careful. I don't want to sound ungrateful by any stretch of the imagination. No, you guys, for... I, I'm really touched that you guys are interested in watching me play games. To think that someone would be interested in watching me play games. To think that I'm worth their time, really, it's like, that's that's humble. And thank you for your time. That, that really is cool. Um, but even then, just recording... Like, I like YouTube... Because not it, it feels like a bounce of like a digital garden that I get to mend and tend. So, like, even like so like for like these less plays, even if no one watches them, they kinda give me like the sense of accomplishment. Because it, it, it's kinda like work that I get to do, and then I look at it and it's like, okay, you know, like this was a job well done. Um and it's a fun journey anyways to be like, okay, how many games can I play on my channel like? And now I look at my my playlist is a let's play since like wow I've played a lot of games over the years and that's really cool. And and that pleases me to no end. And like and seeing where the journey takes you is like you know, I'm, I'm curious to see what I'll end up playing in the future. Certainly. Uh but also uh there is something else I want to say. There's something in the back of my head is like this is exactly what I want to say, but of course I forgot it. So the tip of the is gone now. It's gone forever. Man, and that's gonna bug me. Like, you know, you yeah, had something you want to say, and you really want to say it, and then it's just like, you can't. Oh, see, now I'm not even gonna get the chance, because I think I end the episode right here. Pretty quick. No, 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 no. Okay, I have a good time. Oh, I was gonna redeem myself. What was I gonna say? Film it. Oh, also, one thing I like about YouTube is like, it gives me an excuse to play games, because as I've, as I've gotten older, it's becoming harder to find time to play games. No, 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 no. Fuck. Oh, I'm gonna have to remember to continue this in the next episode. Oh, but I might not remember. No, 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 I'm still here. Oh my goodness. I should actually just look at the timestamp. Okay, cool. I have like 40 seconds to go. Okay. Um, because if I didn't have YouTube, I wouldn't be playing as many single player games as I am right now, right? Like, because of YouTube, I've been able to play Super Mario Odyssey. I've played Castlevania. I've played. Uh, StarCraft Remastered, I've played The Evil Within, like, all these games that I might not have played otherwise, because I'm like, oh, I'll just play online. And like, it gives me, like, it sounds like a sense of purpose. Uh, and I guess I'll be something to talk about next episode. It's like, I feel like YouTube's been very, like, psychologically good for me. 
like, the success I've been getting on YouTube is very nice, don't get me wrong, it's been an amazing thing, but beyond that, it's, um, I think just mentally good for me, but I guess we're going to end the episode, so goodbye guys, thank you all for watching.